we're going to be delving into a story today that has rocked the aerospace sector and will alter the course of Elon Musk's leading businesses. In this exciting investigation, we solve the riddles of SpaceX's most recent building breakthrough, from the rough prototypes that it began with to the shining, sturdy marvel that it is today. This will change Tesla and SpaceX's relationship forever. We follow the dramatic evolution of spaceship welding processes. This voyage is evidence of SpaceX's unwavering pursuit of innovation and excellence as well as its technological prowess. However, this development's effects transcend beyond space travel. Beyond how it affects Tesla, we'll look at the links and ramifications for the company's stock as SpaceX keeps pushing the envelope in terms of innovation and technology. Follow along as we reveal how SpaceX transformed the welding process on Starships, conquering significant obstacles and establishing new benchmarks for the sector. Culminating in an unexpectedly spectacular first orbital test launch that captured the attention of the entire globe. You won't want to miss how all of these advancements will propel Tesla to new heights. Take advantage of this engrossing story of creativity, resiliency, and space exploration, but not before you hit the like and subscribe buttons to show your support. Greetings and welcome to Tesla Stock News. Now that we have cleared things out, let's begin this video. The creation of the Starship program starting with the Starhopper prototype in early 2019, the voyage will culminate in the much-anticipated orbital testing and represent a major technological advancement for SpaceX. By August 2019, the 65-foot-tall Starhopper had progressed from its humble beginnings, barely lifting off the ground, to more ambitious attempts, culminating in a 500-foot flight. Though the process cleared the way for larger prototypes, there were obstacles along the way. Problems surfaced during a pressure test of the first major prototype, MCK-1, in November 2019. While the SN-4 prototype marked a turning point with successful static fire tests, the SN-1 and SN-3 variants suffered explosions during ground testing. The 2020 SN5 and SN6 prototypes underwent 500 test flights. The SN8 prototype was introduced in December 2020 with the goal of reaching a higher height of 6 meters. Nevertheless, it exploded upon landing at 7.8 meters. Similarly, the SN9 test in early 2021 crashed during a high altitude test flight because of an engine ignition problem following the successful SN115 test. Arriving at land SpaceX suspended Starship test flights to concentrate on getting ready for orbital testing. The objective is to confirm the Starship for despite SpaceX's original less ambitious space missions, like delivering astronauts to the International Space Station, recent improvements will be crucial in 2022 for the company's worth. In its initial funding round, SpaceX aimed to raise at least $11.72 billion in order to increase its valuation to as much as $11,227 billion. The Starship program at Starlink, many of whose launches in 2023 will showcase SpaceX's strong operational capabilities, is one of the factors contributing to this expansion. Due in large part to investments from organizations such as Anderson Horowitz, an early SpaceX investor, the company's valuation has surged to $137 billion. The money raised in these rounds, which reportedly totaled $750 million, will go towards developing SpaceX's ambitious Starship program, which is anticipated to be the cornerstone of the company's future ambitions. These events point to a high level of investor confidence in SpaceX's future, supported by the Starship program's advancement. The pressure that Tesla's shareholders are putting on CEO Elon Musk is indicative of the differences between SpaceX's rising valuation and some of the company's difficulties. However, given the interwoven performance of Musk's ventures, the developments in investor Interest in SpaceX, especially in the Starship program, are probably going to boost Tesla's valuation. From the early prototypes to the more sophisticated models, SpaceX's journey with the Starship demonstrates an unwavering pursuit of technological improvement. For those who are interested in the investment side of innovative firms like SpaceX and Tesla, this kind of innovation is not simply confined to the aerospace industry. A wealth of information can be found at Seeking Alpha, which gives in-depth research and updates on businesses that are shaping the future, such as SpaceX-affiliated Tesla. 
Seeking Alpha is a great resource if you want to remain ahead of the investing curve, especially with businesses like Tesla. Don't forget to click the link in the description to take advantage of a special Black Friday deal. Due to carbon fiber's superior strength to weight ratio, SpaceX originally intended to construct the Starship out of it. However, after learning about carbon fiber's temperature restrictions, they decided to use stainless steel instead. Although this change presented welding issues, these were offset by the use of advanced techniques such as friction stir welding and robotic welding, as well as tip TIG welding. The two businesses' synergy is demonstrated by the incorporation of Tesla technology, such as the use of Tesla battery packs for Starship power. SpaceX's embrace of advanced manufacturing techniques, like FSW in the Model Y, that Tesla also uses, demonstrates a reciprocal technological advancement through collaboration and a common innovation spirit. By demonstrating the combined innovation skills of Elon Musk's firms, the success and developments of SpaceX's Starship project, which includes the integration of Tesla technology, can have a favorable effect on Tesla's growth. This might increase investor confidence and raise Tesla's market valuation. SpaceX improved the structural integrity and exterior look of the spacecraft by honing their welding processes. In order to match the strength of the welds with the surrounding metal, they ground down surfaces and applied pressure to the spaceship in order to solve the first welding problems. The Mark I prototype's explosion caused by a faulty weld serves as evidence of how important this was. Using Tesla motors and battery packs for both in-flight and on-ground testing, SpaceX integrated Tesla hardware into the spacecraft. For example, the 200 kW of battery power used in the SN3 prototype was probably supplied by Tesla. This methodology mirrors SpaceX's implementation of agile development approaches, akin to Tesla's swift iterations towards enhanced designs. Additionally, SpaceX used cutting-edge welding methods, such as automated friction stir welding and odic welding machines, which fuse metal together without completely melting and provide strong, flawless bonds that are essential for the harsh conditions of space travel. This eco-friendly method improves the welded surface's appearance as well, which is crucial for a prominent spacecraft like the Starship. SpaceX's dedication to innovation and quality is demonstrated by their usage of FSW, which was initially used in the second stage assembly of the Falcon 99 in 2008. Tesla too has taken use of the efficiency of FSW in products like as the model, applying it to aluminium components and thermal management systems. It's crucial to keep the financial viewpoint in mind when we examine the intricacies of SpaceX's Starship construction, from breakthroughs in structural design to advancements in welding. A key player in SpaceX's success, Tesla is one of the firms that our colleagues at Seeking Alpha examine in depth when it comes to technology and innovation. SpaceX continues to innovate with a special Black Friday offer that can be found by clicking the link in the description. With the Starship project, SpaceX's unwavering quest for innovation resulted in the use of laser welding. The deep penetration of this technique made it possible to weld complete ring segments in a single pass, thus increasing the strength of the weld. To further strengthen the structure, SpaceX switched from building smaller steel panels to using full steel coils. These coils, which were positioned on specific supports, created an exact circle with a diameter of 9 meters. They were then cold rolled, which lengthens and compresses the metal grains and fortifies the steel. The steel pieces are rolled, chopped, and then welded into continuous, strong rings. But the heat from the welding process weakens the metal, so SpaceX used a huge planishing machine to combat this. By planishing the welds to match the surrounding metal's hardness, strength, and look are increased. After that, the steel rings, or rings, as SpaceX frequently refers to them, are piled and fused on a specific fixture. This new technique improves the ship's production environment by reducing the amount of individual welds and speeding up assembly. The use of laser welding in the Starship project is one example of SpaceX's inventiveness. The use of steel coils and cutting-edge metal treatment methods like planishing shows a commitment to technical brilliance that is consistent with Tesla's values. 
the success of prototypes such as the Ship 24 and Booster 7 and the rigorous approach to testing and design that was demonstrated during Starship's development Tesla's dedication to product innovation and quality under shared leadership, this creativity, synergy, and attitude to problem-solving may increase investor trust in Tesla. SpaceX has demonstrated its skills through the success of its ambitious initiatives, which might improve Tesla's market perception and valuation. Starship's development involved rigorous testing using a range of prototypes, from SN1 to SN15, each of which improved and validated the spacecraft's capabilities and design. With the development of the Super Heavy Booster, a crucial part of the spacecraft's first stage, during this iterative process, the Starship's booster technology advanced significantly, despite obstacles like damage during cryogenic proof tests and problems during static fire tests. Significant progress was made as a result of SpaceX's continual improvement strategy. One example is Booster 7, which successfully completed a battery of tests with a 31 engine. An essential component of this development was static firing. Velmet Process Vessel 24 tests were also conducted on another crucial component of the Starship assembly, which helped identify and address any potential structural flaws and improve the spacecraft's overall robustness and design. SpaceX's state-of-the-art technological advancement is demonstrated by their Starship innovations, which include laser welding using whole steel coils and planishing to harden welds. These improvements highlight SpaceX sound test fail-fix methodology, especially in the case of the successful maiden orbital test. The valuation of Tesla may be impacted by this unrelenting innovation. In the past, Tesla's stock has responded favorably to SpaceX's accomplishments. Elon Musk's collaborative leadership style and technological synergy imply that SpaceX's achievements, like Starship's advancements, may boost Tesla's investor base. This assurance, which stems from Musk's capacity to spearhead innovative projects, may result in heightened investor interest in Tesla and raise the company's market value. Additionally, SpaceX's operations raise awareness of Tesla's brand, which helps Tesla's financial line indirectly. One example of how NASA uses Tesla vehicles to get astronauts to mission launch pads is that it gives the Tesla brand a lot of exposure and free publicity. These events raise public awareness of Tesla vehicles because they are frequently streamed live. One of the main factors contributing to SpaceX's success has been its dedication to innovation in the building of